There's new hope in the coronavirus pandemic. We could have a fully FDA approved vaccine by the end of the summer. Medical experts say it could get us one step closer to a vaccine for young children too. The question now, will it come too late? It's full speed ahead to get full FDA approval for Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine, and sources told the New York Times it could happen as soon as Labor Day. But time is working against them. Less than half of the population is fully vaccinated, and we're averaging more than 85,000 new cases a day. The hope is final approval will motivate more people to get vaccinated. It's also expected to prompt more vaccine mandates, and it could accelerate the approval process for vaccines for kids under 12. When you have an EUA for the vaccine that then goes to a full approval, that might have an influence on what goes on. We're collecting the data right now for what we need to make that determination. Until then, more children and teens are getting COVID. Nearly 72,000 got it between July 22nd and the 29th, a substantial increase from 39,000 cases the week before. A new study shows long-term symptoms are less common for children than adults, but kids can have persistent symptoms or worse. This variant is capable of causing serious illness in children. And some experts worry even a quick FDA approval might come too late. At the rate they're going, it might be a moot point by the time they actually get it licensed because you could have variants generated that then now escape the vaccines. Of course, vaccines being made available and people actually getting them are two very different things. According to the state of Florida, as of Friday, only 38% of eligible 12 to 19 year olds had received their COVID-19 vaccination.